With a library this size, it's not easy finding some kind of system, but Malcolm likes to challenge himself, as we know all too well. Here, for example, Malcolm is organizing major literary works according to the year of death of the author. Schopenhauer, 1860, September 20. This is usually the point where I interrupt him to see if the smartest guy I know has any questions for me. Here's one. Science has always been a third-person description of the world. If, in the realm of artificial intelligence, we hold to Hoffman's model, namely that its conscious agents and observers continue down the line ad infinitum, every one of them a first-person point of view, then what happens to the observation of science in the grand scheme of things? Um, no idea, Malcolm. But maybe Malcolm has another one in store for us, possibly a question related to our own industry? Fair enough. Is there a way to create a more efficient drying line that could service the need for combined bicarbonate and food production? Huh? That's a great question. Like, how can you increase the output without thermal degradation? I'm sure we can answer that. See, this white crystalline powder here is sodium bicarbonate. I'm sure Malcolm knows this, but in organic chemistry, bicarbonate is a polyatomic ion with the formula HCO3. And if it looks somewhat familiar, well, that's because the most common salt of the bicarbonate is NaHCO3, sodium bicarbonate, or baking soda. But in pure form, it also finds application in the medical field. Sodium bicarbonate is the agent most commonly used to correct metabolic acidosis and buffer the pH value of the blood of patients with limited kidney functions and delay the need for hemodialysis. Because the market for bicarbonate is steadily expanding, many producers must increase throughput and their production capacities. And how does Andritz separation accomplish this? With the use of peeler and pusher centrifuges, a better dewatering can be achieved, and a fluid bed dryer with internal heat exchangers can handle multiple capacity on the same footprint of installation. With the use of these unique centrifuges and fluid bed dryers, Andritz separation serves the needs of the world's largest food and pharmaceutical sodium bicarbonate factories. Its carbon dioxide drying atmosphere prevents thermal degradation to maintain the highest levels of purity. For the world's largest production lines for sodium bicarbonate, Andritz separation helps reduce energy consumption by 15% and reaches an annual capacity of 100,000 tons. Our products are the answer to Malcolm's question. Andritz separation helps bicarbonate production grow bigger in output while maintaining purity. Top. Nice. Nice answer. Thanks, Malcolm. A thumbs up is always welcome. Though, it does look a, a little strange coming from you. Schopenhauer.